But right now, all new at six. The past three years have seen a dip in CMS students graduating on time. A district report, in fact, showing that trend hitting students with English as their second language, particularly hard. But tonight, WCNC Charlotte's Shamaria Morrison shows us one senior who beat the odds in handily. Jason Serrato is a high school senior everyone just can't help but to love. He's also the one you admire. He's a star soccer player, has a part-time job, and wait for it. And what's your GPA? 4.0. <laughs> the helpful high school senior lives with his aunt and uncle. My uncle and aunt, she, they were trying to give me like a better opportunity, you know, for education and stuff. Jason left his parents back in Honduras. That's me, my mom, and my brother. My mom and when I was little. Because I was there and I did like my elementary school in Honduras. So I was trying to learn English and everything. So I was like, it's better if I come here. Jason talks to his mom every day. It's annoying, but I have to, man. I have to. Yeah, I'm trying to like stay in communication with me, her. Because after what happened with my dad, you know, she feels like kind of lonely and stuff. That's because Jason's dad died two years ago. The teen sought guidance from his soccer coach and extended family who inspired him. Being away from your family, I was like, gotta get used to it, learn English and all this. So it was challenging. But I always feel like that pressure, like I need to do better, you know, to make them feel proud. At CMS, 65% of English language learners are graduating in four years or less. That's better than the national average, but still about 18 percentage points behind the average of all students. And Jason says keeping up with his peers while also learning English was challenging. But one teacher was his advocate. I'm really thankful because she was like another mother for me. She was always taking care, asking me how I was doing, helping with homework, like with my college classes, homework. She was always there. When he walks across the graduation stage in a few weeks, he'll have a lot of reasons to be proud. Shamari Morrison, WCNC Charlotte. We are proud of him and wish him continued success.